The Red Lake girls basketball team has made the state tournament before two years ago in 2017. But the team is still looking for their first ever win at state, and today they tried to pick it up against topped ranked and only once beaten Minneota. Red Lake was not phased by the big stage as they jumped out on the Vikings early. Jerrica Kingbird finds Latia Pemberton underneath for the deuce, and the Warriors are off to a 14-4 lead. But Minneota showed why they're number one as Abby Hennen hits the three to give the Vikings a 15-14 lead. Red Lake down 14 at the half, but in the second, Kalana McLean goes coast to coast, part of a 14-7 run. Warriors down 10 with nine to play. Angel McLean tries to bring Red Lake back with a three, but that was as close as the Warriors would get. Tighter than the score would indicate as they fall 66-46. Sport, sports reporter Anthony Scott has more on how rebounding played a big factor in today's game. Red Lake jumped out to a 14-4 lead and you could sense an upset brewing. But Minneota showed why they were the number one seed, out rebounding the Warriors 66-37 on their way to a quarterfinal victory. We knew from the get-go that they're a good rebounding team and you know regardless of uh, who was shooting the basketball we just have to put a body on 52 and there's their main rebounder and you know she's she's pretty dominant under there and she's big so really athletic too and you know bottom line is we just need to be better as a rebounding team and you know not have any let-ups on a defensive end. Yeah we were in boxing out and we needed to to be able to win the game. It almost seemed like we play a little lackadaisy, you know, set satisfied with the lead, but at the same time, we got to have that killer instinct to put them away right there. I mean, could have been different if we would have kept the intensity up. We're just grateful to be here, and at the same time, we would have loved to win that game, but at the same time, we got another one to look forward to tomorrow. So, uh, other than that, very pleased with our girls tonight. Red Lake still has a chance to make their mark at the state tournament as they will play in the consolation bracket tomorrow at 10 a.m. Reporting from Minneapolis, Anthony Scott, Lakeland News. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.